True or false? Young and Thug and Three is your last musical project, solo musical project by you. Yeah. Forever? It's true. Um, my last studio album will be Young and Thug and Three, Y and T Three. You know, um, I'm getting older now, man, and I have had talks, you know, with a lot of bosses. You know, um, Birdman being one of them. You know, and um. You know, he just brought it to my attention, like, man, Turk, man, it's time for you to, you know, you done learned a whole lot in this game. You know, um, it's time for you to start bringing your own artists out, boss up. You know, and I, I thought about it, because, you know, I was locked up, so I was like, man, I need to try to finish what I started. But the game done changed so much, you know what I'm saying? I didn't put out so much music to where I feel like maybe it is time for me to, Dropped my last album, which I believe gonna be a classic. You know, um, I reached out to Manny Fresh. You know, Manny Fresh produced my whole Young and Thuggin album, which was my first solo album on Cash Money. So, um, just trying to take it back to the roots, man, and give them that 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 last Young and Thuggin what they remember. You know, without being too young with it, but keeping it Thuggin at the same time. And I think. My fans who are Young and Thuggin fans, who are Turk solo artist fans, they're going to appreciate it. You know, um, I'm not rushing it. I'm taking my time, but it's sure to be out 2017, and it's going to be my last studio album. So does that mean you're going to refrain from jumping on a person's song as a feature or jumping on remixes? Um, I mean, you know, I'm putting out my own artist, so... They might want me to get on the album. I'm not gonna force myself on the album. If they be like OG, cause all uh, they call me OG. Now I didn't accept the OG. Now at first I used to be mad when they's like, man, you the OG, man, bam, bam. Like man, nigga, I ain't no OG, you know, cause that feel old. But I didn't accept it because of the things I didn't been through in my life, man, and you know the wisdom that I got to give back to the world. If they want me on the album, you know, I'm on it. I'm not gonna force myself on it though. I see. So would you can uh, so would you say this is you're just retiring as a solo artist? Yeah, yeah. Is that what you would call it? Yeah. No more albums. That's it. No more being in the studio working like a Hebrew slave. That's it. You know what I'm saying? We gonna do it. We gonna do it fast, quick, easy, smart. Get straight to the point. You know, when you're doing an album, man, you have to really sit back and analyze is this good enough is my fans gonna appreciate this like you have to really think about it versus doing a verse you know what i'm saying you just the spur of the moment like what the topic is let's talk about it and bam you just get it in something might have happened today let me talk about that bam you done laid a hot 16 a hot 12 a hot 8 you know what i'm saying so yeah